Hi, Coach Javi. My name is Jaspreet. And my name is Devraj. And both of us love your videos very, very much. Uh, this will be our goal scoring celebration video to enter for your giveaway. Before we start this video, I just want to say thank you to everyone who entered into the giveaway and congratulations to Jaspreet and Devraj. Guys, I love the video. I thought it was very, very creative. So I will be emailing you guys very, very soon and sending you the training top. Now, let's get on with the video. Strap yourselves in, my friends. Today, the journey begins. How's it going everyone? Day one of coming back to work. Guess where we are at? I'm about to give you the tour. If I can find this key right here. The magic key that opens up. The magic lock that opens up. The magic door that opens up to the magic office. Welcome to Coach Javi's office. I'll give you guys a little tour real quick. So, we have the World Cup there. I won this bad boy back in Germany a few years back. A TV for when we watch film with the players. This is where the players sit down when they come in. That's my chair. Got the laptop. Got the boot room. That's where I hang up the boots and the coaching, coaching shoes. Of course, the Gunners. And my boy Rock. Me and him are like this. And uh, we have a little fridge here and a microwave, but it's not complete without a full stack of monsters. Gotta make sure you have your monsters, my friends. <sighs> okay, schedule for today. Since we're just back, this is day one. We have about a week before our preseason starts. So I'll try to vlog little bits and pieces because I'll be coaching most of the time, but that's what we got planned for today. I'm gonna edit some video for a little bit. Dang, it's already ready, look at that. Videoception. Video set. I don't know if you can see this. It's pretty early, but um, we're gonna edit a little bit of video. But besides that, let's get on with our day. I believe. Brad, I'm guessing you're an outside backer. Do you want to play a outside? <laughs> Rudy, you're getting benched too, so I'm sorry. Here. All right, all right, let's bring it <laughs> in for the motivational talk. Let's go. King talk. I just want to say this is the most important moment of your lives, but don't injure anyone. Yeah. What? I don't know. Oh, yeah. No two for the tackles, Deep. please. Oh. Gang, gang, gotta put me. Alright, let's get bring it in. Out. Again, just having fun. We're trying to give everyone some playing time. Besides that, don't lose this game. I want to keep a perfect record on my all-star career. Alright? Alright, let's get out there, boys. And girls. Let's get out there. Brad, you got benched. Residential camp is over. Coach Javi was in charge of coaching the all-star team at the end. And guess what? After 90 minutes of parking the bus, we came out on top. Um, so we got a few days till preseason, but I think it's time I showed you guys something. I'm sure a lot of you have been waiting for this. So let's go. But first of all, 
so I don't really feel like walking. We're gonna take the shortcut instead. And I know you guys like the shortcut. Alright. Boom! Magic, my friends. Magic. You know, in a past life, I could have been a magician. I'm not sure. So guess where we're at? So if you guys have seen basically any one of the training videos, you'll know that this is where the magic happens, my friends. This is our game field. So the nice part about working down in the south is that the fields, most of them, because of the warm temperatures year round, can have Bermuda grass. Bermuda grass is the stuff that the pros use. It's the really, really nice looking stuff. Look at this. Look at how flat that is. So, as you can tell, this is quality right here. This is quality and they're prepping it right now for our preseason and for our season. So it's really, really nice, really, really flat. They haven't painted the lines or anything, but the grass is just fantastic. It's fantastic. So I figured while we're here, let's have a little chat. So if you guys haven't noticed, Coach Javi tends to not answer a certain question every time he gets asked in the comment section. Now the reason I don't answer it is not because I don't want to tell you guys, it's because I wanted to wait till I got back to work for me to actually answer it properly. I understand that when I signed up for the whole YouTube thing, especially when I started doing the vlogs, that I was going to have to be completely open with you guys, completely honest, and I can't hide certain parts of my life. Because you have to be able to see it in order for you to really connect with me, right? So, the million dollar question, well, I guess not worth that much, but what university do you coach at? And is it Division 1, Division 2, or Division 3, right? So for the second part of that question, it is Division 1. It's a small school, but it is Division 1. Now for the first part of that question, I've been waiting a while to do this. Pretty excited. Without further ado, my friends, welcome to Gardner-Webb University. And there you guys have it. So I don't want to turn this into a Q&A, but I do want to do a Q&A. So I figured if you have any other questions for me, things that you would like me to answer, it can be about absolutely anything. Let's do a Q&A soon. 20,000. 20,000 subscribers. When we hit 20,000 subscribers, boom, Q&A video will come out. So in the comment section of this video, go ahead and write down all the questions. I'll make an Instagram post as well. Instagram post, you guys can ask any questions down there as well. So, ugh. a few more plants for today. Coloco, who is uh, one of the guys that I train. If you guys have watched any of my training videos, you'll see this guy. Huh? He is playing in the PDL, which is the Premier Development League over the summer, which is like semi-pro, and his team is in the national semifinals. So, he's playing about an hour away. I think we're gonna go and catch the game. Now, I don't wanna take all the credit, but I will take the credit actually. If it wasn't for Coach Javi's individual sessions, this guy would be a nobody. No, I'm just kidding. No, he's actually a very good player and uh, he's playing on a pretty good team in Charlotte, down here in North Carolina. So we're gonna go watch him play um, and hopefully he gets the W and he moves on to the national championship. Besides that, I have to assemble the wall that I built or the two walls that I built because I couldn't have them assembled on the way here. So I have to go assemble those and then probably get some food and then drive down to Charlotte and see him play. Cue the time lapse of Coach Javi building a wall. In three, two, one. Well, that only took like six hours. Oh man, my back is killing me. Ugh. But we got it done, look my friends. Boom, 
ready for the season boom double time still gotta put the logo on this one and gotta fix the logo on that one so it's not so big and obnoxious but coach javi does have jb stickers would anybody be interested in some jb stickers so got that done now i just gotta put them away we'll go get something to eat and then we're off to charlotte to see my boy coloco score some goals and show the people the top ends techers that coach javi taught him how to do so off we go my friends all right real quick before we go get some to eat and then go watch coloco i wanted to address this as well coach javi puts up his sunday league highlights right and i get some comments on there saying one you're playing against a bunch of old fat guys which is true two why aren't you playing at a higher level and three there's no three. Those are the two. So the reason why I don't play at a higher level, guys, is because I have officially retired from competitive soccer. I play Sunday League as a way for me to go out there, get some exercise, and just have a little bit of fun. I have played at a higher level, but I'm on my way down now. You get what I'm saying? Like, I'm I'm like Pirlo in the MLS. You guys don't believe me, and, and you think, oh, he plays well in Sunday League, but how well would he do against actual competitive players? I will show you. Would have been on goal, but... Good ball, and, and ball he's going! In the back of the net. There we go. Javi Bautista. Yeah. Golazo. Strikes. Pierre Bautista strikes goal for Detroit City. To stop 33. As you said, Zeke, they just flat out forgot about Javier they Bautista. And, and, and he, he jumped on the opportunity jumped on it. That's well done. That's what you want out of your forward. That goes back to being in the right place at the right time. And he has sent a bolt of lightning through this crowd here at Keyworth Stadium. He was an All-American during his time in college. As a senior in college, scored 11 goals in 19 games. So again, guys, I'm on my way down. I'm retired. I have dedicated my life to coaching. Coaching is my passion. Playing was great, but my career is over. That's why I'm only playing Sunday League. But, um, but yeah, so if you want to know more about that, about my career, about my playing career, ask a question right down below in the comment section for the Q&A. Ask it, and I will answer it, my friends. Okay, now we're off to go see Colloquia. There he is, the legend himself. Boss, how you doing? Congratulations, man. Thanks, Congratulations. Man. This is the uh, one of the biggest uh, stars of the YouTube channel, bro. <laughs> People comment on, on your videos all the time. For real? Who's that guy? He's not that good. He's not that good. Nah. <laughs> Who wants to see some more uh, some more training sessions with this guy? Huh? Click on that. Let him know. Let me know. Let, let me know. know. <laughs> the coach is like, they're like, wow, your passing has been it's very, very good, like the technique and stuff. Yeah. Little did I know how much work you put in. Give a, uh, give a five star review to Coach Javi training. <laughs> 20 stars. <laughs> 20, 20 stars. Alright, boss. Up a nice though. I'll let you get uh, changed, but hey, nice seeing you. Thanks hey. for coming out, Javi. My boy got the W, so now they're on to the national championship, so we will be back. Thank you very much. Okay. Alright. Back home we go. Alright. We are back at the office. Now, decided to come back and edit just a little bit. I got back at like 10.30, right? Started editing, and now look at the time. But, got everything done here, for the most part. So, one, Coach Javi needs to get a life, and two, Coach Javi needs to get some sleep. So again, feel free to comment down below any questions you're gonna have for the Q&A once we get to 20,000. So if you're watching this and you haven't subscribed yet, Click that subscribe button, my friends. As far as the camps, and I know I talked about it like two episodes ago, as far as the camps, this vlog has already gone on long enough, so in the next one, we'll talk about it more in depth, but I am very excited to talk about that. So I'll see you guys on the next one. Have a good night.